guys with the, who were the uh, receivers that have been having a really good spring so far? Uh, Malcolm Mitchell's made a lot of strides. Um, Isaiah McKenzie's had a very good spring so far. Uh, Reggie Davis has, has continued to improve and had a very good spring right now so, uh, so far as well. So, uh, you know, those three guys in particular uh, have done well. Uh, Justin, Justin's come a long way as well, but he still has a little, a little more ways to go. Really just kind of getting confidence back in his game and confidence back in his body and, you know, being able to kind of get back to old form a little bit. But, uh, you know, all those guys have pretty much done well, pretty much across the board. All that time, Coach, how did you turn? Uh, it's, it's, to be honest with you, it's, it, feel, it feels like I'm back at home. Uh, I, you know, the toughest part about it all was really just leaving, leaving those guys in that room that kind of that, that kind of I was leaving. You know, when, uh, you know, but you know, those guys took it actually a lot better than I did initially. Uh, I mean, obviously, I knew I wanted to do it. Uh, you know, me and coach had actually talked about doing that before. You know, uh, years ago. Uh, you know, as far as, you know, what I want to make that move to go back to coaching receivers. And uh, obviously, because that's what I did when I was a graduate assistant. You know, that's, that's, that was all I had known, really, until I went and coached running backs. And so, um, just all the familiarity just kind of came rushing back at once. And, you know, it's, it's been a ball. So, in, in terms of, like, the drills you do and how you run a practice, have you, what have you uh, dealt with? Have you, did you talk Tony, did you copy uh, stuff? You know, like a lot of, uh, like I said, you know, up until I coached running backs, all I'd known was wide receiver. That's all I'd known. That's all I played here. It's what I played when I was with the Chicago Bears, you know, for you know for that brief period of time. And uh, obviously, me and that coach that I had, Daryl Drake, up there with the Chicago Bears, and, you know, we, have, we still have a good relationship. We talk once a week. Uh, obviously, still got my old position coach in the house here, Co- Coach Easton, John Easton. Uh, so, I mean, you know, just the familiarity as far as what works and what to do and everything else, all that stuff. You know, it's just kind of a second nature, to be honest with you. But, um, you know, it's just it's, as far as just planning out and really getting an evaluation and seeing what guys needed to get better at across the board is kind of how I've always structured practice and how I'm going to kind of keep doing it. So when Coach Easton retired, was that when you had a conversation about, hey, you know? No, it was a little bit after that. Uh, it was a little bit after that. But, you know, just really more so as far as kind of what I want to be, uh, the, you know, just as far as just seeing, seeing me in a bunch of different roles and, and everything.